started 22 or 23 years ago um, as a mechanism for reporting out on research that was done here as part of the LTR. Over the years, it's varied. We've opened it up to any range of research that's going on here or that's pertinent to the work that goes on here. Um, but the session that we're going to have today is very much geared towards the LTER program uh, because we're coming up on um, the end of our fourth round of funding from the National Science Foundation and we're writing a proposal that will be due in February for another six years of, of funding. So I want to give just a little bit of background for people who don't know about the LTER program and know about um, the Harvard Forest effort so that you can understand the kind of context for the, the talk uh, this morning. So the National Science Foundation, about 30 years ago, started up the Long-Term Ecological Research Program with the idea that a suite of sites would be funded um, on the six-year grants that could be renewable based on the strength of their site research. There now are 26 sites that uh, extend from Antarctica to two, two sites in Antarctica to two sites in Alaska, uh, South Pacific in California to uh, Puerto Rico, and three sites in New England. There's Hubbard Brook in the White Mountains, the Plum Island Ecosystem Study, which is in the North Shore, looking at green and, and stream ecology, and the Harvard Forest Site. We were established in uh, 1988 um, with a suite of investigators representing uh, the institutions that um, are still going to be represented here, plus some additions since then. But we started off with uh, Steve Watsey uh, from Harvard, Fakri Bazanis from Harvard, uh, Jerry Malillo <laughs> made up an effort in the Ecosystem Center, Woods Hole, John Neighbor from the University of of New Hampshire, and those institutions have uh, remained kind of um, at the core of the LTR program. We've added the um, University of Massachusetts, large number of researchers there, Boston <coughs> University, um, Woods Hole Research Center, Fuller um, um and, and a range of, of others. Um, what we've asked the um, the researchers to do today is to report on past work and to try to synthesize that and point to future directions so that we can use that and inform in the discussions that we're going to have, uh, we've been having, and we'll continue tomorrow morning as we try to um, identify future directions for research. So what we'll be hearing from today is a suite of studies, they don't represent the uh, total sum of research that goes on here, but the major major theme and many of the major activities. Um, and we'll also have some studies that um, are just starting up that look like they'll provide some promising directions to the future. The, back, the basic kind of structure of the LTR is that there are long-term measurements, large long-term experiments, um, modeling studies, and increasingly an interaction between physical, biological, and social sciences. Um, the core of the research, the core of the program is really based on site science, but there's an increasing emphasis on doing regional studies that then involve cross-site, inter-site work, and then network-wide work. And so you'll hear a range of, of those um, um, this morning afternoon. The way we've structured things today is to have short talks, 15-minute talks, with um, probably one or two at most short questions right afterwards. But we're really going to save our questions so that we can have a half an hour discussion after three or four talks in each of the sessions. So it's structured so we have two or three or four short talks and then discussion and what we'd really like to do is to engage the audience in some kind of thought-provoking and uh, kind of challenging questions about synthesis and about future directions for the research, um, as opposed to a lot of nitpicky questions about the methods and, and details. 
Um, so if you've got a lot of those, hold those for later and uh, uh, talk to the speakers afterwards. Um, but we'd like to engage in some kind of synthetic discussions of the two or three or four talks that we hear at any given session. Um, and <coughs>